Hey guys, hope you are doing well. Um, I'm not very good with facing camera, so I'll just get directly to it. Today's video is about installing this uh, stainless steel radiator guard from RR16. It's an Indian company on my Adventure 390. So without wasting any more time, let's get directly to it. To start with, you need to open these Allen screws. I have a ratchet, so I'll just use it for convenience. Once it is a little loose, you can just take it out with your fingers. Keep it somewhere safe, don't lose it. You will have the same set of uh, Allen screws on the other side as well. You need to take that out. And once these four are done, you also need to take these two. I've added the extension stem on the ratchet for convenience. The sound of ratchet is oddly satisfying, isn't it? This should come off now. Unless there's something else. Okay. So pull it from the top and there should be a lock on the lower side as well, if you can see. Let me change the angle a little. Yeah, here. So the radiator guard has two extensions. You can see it goes right over there. This is how they compare against each other. There are two rubber washers over here. You need to take them out and you need to put it over there. So what I figured out is if you have these washers inside these grooves, um, these screws will not go in because of this uh, added extension. So I went the other way around. What I did is I have put the washer behind this and then install the screw so that way it should sit in place and also it won't have any sort of noise because of it now once this is done and the other side is done you need to install these two screws as well the allen screws and uh, after that you need to tighten them so it's a it's a direct fit i am not struggling with the bolt positions or anything but one thing that i just wanted to let you know let you guys know once you're done uh, with the installation be sure to clean the entire surface with um, maybe rubbing alcohol or a hand sanitizer because if you get this finish the polished finish and if you have your fingerprints over the radiator guard once it heats up that mark is going to stay forever so just be sure of uh, sure to clean it up completely and if you go for the black powder coated finish then it's a different ball game you did not need to worry about that to finish off i would uh, tighten these balance screws This is how it looks with everything installed. 